Okay, just have to pick Chloe up. Yeah. Thanks to the United Way, we decided we wanted to bring the two communities of Ocean Man First Nation and Stoughton together to build connections with our children through language, through reading and through social skills, building friendships and relationships that will hopefully go on for years. For the students to be able to access a program that they can learn and have fun and just be supported in their learning, it's really, really important. In many small town rural communities, there are not as much programming for kids as obviously kids in the city. So anything that we can provide something that's uh, structured with some guidance and some support and just some you know good role modeling for our kids to learn how to interact with each other it makes a world of difference for the kids we come here and then we um, eat breakfast and read as a class the book we read we make a craft about the book and then we go to the library and like read books stuff like that it's a good program to bring in because there's two months off in the summertime, so it's good for them to do some learning and uh, brush up on their reading skills during the summer. Okay, are we ready? I like bugs on good reading. We can see if they have kept their reading level or if this, that horrible summer slide has taken over and they've lost a level or two and just to get back into the process of reading and practicing and the importance of that. During the week of summer success camp, Elder Peter Bigstone was able to attend. We did some language activities with him. What about uh, yellow? D. And then we loaded up and we went to the Lost Horse Hills, which is by the Ocean Man First Nation powwow grounds. Elder Bigstone showed us a few of the traditional plants of sage and fireweed. Then we went for a hike and we went up to the huge hill. We had a good time walking and running down and seeing lots of nature. And the kids just really enjoyed Papa Pete. This has been a very rewarding uh, program for students and for myself. It's so encouraging for them and it's, it's nice during the summer to, to have something for them to do for all the sponsors and the donators. The program is fabulous and well needed in all communities. I just cannot say thank you enough for what you have donated to allow kids in our communities to grow and learn and have a better future.